Hi, this is Miss D at D Special Things. I just wanted to share with you some things that I'll be working on this weekend. But first, I decided to go ahead and show you some stuff. Um, a haul. Yeah, maybe a haul. This right here is a journaling page. Let me move stuff on my dress. I mean, on my desk. This was a journaling page that I wanted to do. I was going to do it on a box, but I decided it would look better as an art page. It is with the Diane Reevely paints and her stamps. And I just wanted to do this, so yeah, I'll be working on this this weekend. I'll complete it, but I did want to show you how it was coming out. It's coming along pretty well. And, um, other than that, there were a few things that I got on the road when I went out of town. And one, I stopped at a yard sale. So, yeah, I got this. I don't know if you can see that and how well I can show it because my camera is over me. But, look, it's a merry-go-round. And I paid a dollar. One dollar for this. So, I'm just sitting here. I have to clean it up and look at it. And it's actually, wait a minute. It's a music box. How cute is that? Yeah, so I'm thinking about putting little stuff in these. Yeah, I'm going to, it's, it's already on the shabby chic side. So, I'm going to shabby chic it up. And decorate that. Yeah, so let me put that down here. Also, only a few things that I came across. I found this right here and I'm trying to figure out. I know before I had some stamping up little things that fit exactly in here. Um, they have their little embellishments and these little round uh, plastic cups. And they fit perfectly in here. I think I'm going to use that for that and find somewhere to sit it. Yeah, um, another thing that I actually got was and I thought it was cute it was this right here and I'm going to alter it now how cute is that it's filthy it's really dirty I'm going to shabby it up and paint it yeah I thought that was so cute yeah so and I paid a quarter I think it was either a quarter or 50 cent for this right here I actually I can't believe I went to a yard sale and got stuff well, I can't. I passed by this one, so and this one I was out of town, and I got the, these little blocks and towels, and it's supposedly is a calendar, but and I think I paid a dollar, one dollar for this, and I don't think, I think yeah, these must be on both sides, but either I'm going to alter this and make it what it is already, let me show you, use it as a calendar, um, the dates in there the dates are on it already I'll see what I'm gonna do with this yes yeah, so let's see one two three four five six so all of the all of the months are there and I think all of the these are there too and I don't know if they have Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday no I don't think they have the days of the week in there but I think they use these little things for placements I don't know but anyway, yeah, that is what I got. And like I said, I paid a dollar for it. Something I thought was really great is I've got this. And I paid 50 cents for this. And guess what it is. Mm, it smells like it's been closed up. There, and I thought these would be great for art journaling. It's uh, pictures of Hawaiian flowers. An album of Hawaiian flowers. I have to just show you all this. And it looks like they're on poster board paper according to the way I don't know what kind of paper this is but would you look at this and the whole the pictures are on a whole sheet of the paper is folded. Isn't that cute? And I could see me using these on a page, an art journal page or put, putting them in a junk journal or something. How cute are those? And then someone had the paper clip there for the red for this. 
So yeah, and they look like some sort of, look at that belly paper. Look how cool that is. Look at the book, and you can actually take it apart and just use those papers. It's by T.J. Mundorf. Maybe I'll look this up and see what these flowers are all about. This was copyright 1943 lithograph sheets. Let me see what I have here. I'm not exactly certain, but I think I'm going to Google this first and see what I come across. See what this is before I tear it up and put it in. Yeah, on my... But that's what I got. And then what else did I get? I only found a few things. Didn't spend much money, but I also got... I went... I did go by, was it Tuesday morning? My Tuesday morning didn't have any new stuff. Now, my manager did call me early in the week, and she told me they had some shells that she was trying to get rid of. Um, I didn't need those, and she didn't have any inventory in yet. So, And I didn't check this week, so I don't know if... Uh, I don't know. I, I've seen other videos, but I don't know what kind of new stuff they got in. Supposedly, they have stamps, and I said I was going to check this weekend, but it is raining cats and dogs here this weekend. It's supposed to be the whole weekend, but I did see Kimbo Creations' uh, video, I think she did last weekend, um, of some stuff she got from Target, and I did go by Target, and I found some gift tags. I found those in those colors and that style, and then I found some of the washi tape. And they only had this color. And I found some of the tape that they had. Um, Scott, no, this is washi tape by Scotch. I got this style. And I got, they said this is masking tape. I got the letters, but this wasn't like the washi tape one. And I think she got a washi tape one. I got uh, some baker's twine in that color. I think I got it in another color too, but... I must have put it in a different package or something. And I got some little sticky notes that say notes. And I got some page flags. And that came from Target. So, And that's all I actually, you know, purchased from there now. Um, and this wasn't even my Target. This was out of town. And then I stopped at Joanne's, which, and I don't, I think... I don't know if they still have a sale going on or if, because I didn't do this video this week. So you, you can check. I did get, I think I got a new Brer because I needed one. This was 30% off and then I got an additional 15 off, I think. I don't know. Yeah, but I purchased this Brer. And like I said, this was last weekend and I didn't get a chance to do a video. I got this stamp. And I think I have it already, but I have to look at my stash. But it was super cheap, so I went ahead and got it. I got, these are things that I have already, the wood veneer pieces. And because they were on sale, I, I went ahead and picked them up. I got two of those. And then I got this one, and it is uh, the Today Memory Noted. And hello, I got that one. Um, I got the Heidi Swap Mink stuff. And like I said, because it was on sale, I just got more of these. I haven't tried my... I don't have the mink. So I'm going to try my stuff. I guess I got two of those. With my laminators, uh, the different ones, I'm trying to see if I need to order Heidi Swap Mink. Um, I've watched several videos. I'm... Uh, thinking you know a lot of videos that I watch they're not because her product don't work or there's a problem with their product it's just the people that are reviewing it are not doing whatever they're doing correctly so I wanted to try this stuff myself I just haven't had a chance to um I think a couple of people have said that their some of their stuff was like a total fail and I'm thinking, okay, I'll give it a try myself to see. Um, I got this one. And th this is stuff that I got already. But because I went to Joanne's, they had quite a few stuff on sale, like I said, last week. But, mm, um, 
I don't know if it was still on sale. I found some sequin. And they were 95, 97 cents. But I think I got these additional. They had additional 15% off of regular sale price stuff. So I did find the um, sequence tape. And I got them in two colors. And then I got the tape works. And these are... I don't know if they're fabric or not, but they're hearts, shaped like hearts, like washi tape, but it's a design. Um, these are flowers, and it's by Tape Works too. And these are butterflies. Yes, yeah, so I got those. And what else did I get? I got this. It was a big die, and it was the butterflies. The smaller ones i got i have the big one already and i wanted the smaller ones and it comes with the embossing i mean with the uh embossing folder yeah i needed another one of these stays on pads so i got one of those and i think that's all that i got from yeah the stores this weekend now i did get some um I did get some online orders in. Let's see if I can find it. Okay, I wanted this stamp. And I had ordered this from Scrapbook Warehouse. Yeah, let's see. This was one of the new ones. This was one of his later ones with the popcorn. The bubblegum machine. I really wanted that one. This right here with the trees. So I ordered it. But... This right here, I also ordered, but guess what? This is repackaged. Um, this right here, if you have this stamp right here, you already have those items. Ta da! So now I have another stamp that I could put in a giveaway or something. Yeah, so I'll see what happens with that. And then the other thing that I ordered was, I have to show you this, and it was came from. Sweet Petunia, I think it was. I got this last week, but I wasn't able to do a video, so I'm going to play with this stamp thing. I ordered the, I think originally I saw this on Amador uh, on his site, and he was talking about go to Sweet Petunia to order their stuff because they were cheaper and they were cheaper. The shipper, shipping and hand, handling was a little steep, but still, they were still cheaper than the other sites that had it. And I got two of the um, magnets. And I got the pad. And I got the clean and shine stuff. Yeah, so I'm, I'm going to try this out. I uh, I don't know if I really needed that, but I ordered it because I thought it was a good idea when I looked at the video. So, yeah, that is what I'm going to... Um, I'm going to... Yeah, pl uh, play with this weekend. But anyway, as I said, that is my haul. Those are the goodies that I came across this weekend. I'll be doing some art journaling and I also have some stuff I need to do for work. So I'll be playing with that this weekend. I'm going to see how much stuff I can get out before the uh, weekend is over because I won't be here next weekend. So yeah, this will be a little, little short weekend for me. I also sent out two packages, the embellishment boxes that I did to uh, Angie Bell and to uh, Wendy Days. Let me know if you receive your boxes because I see that they were delivered but Angie Bell's yours has something strange about sending it to an alternate address and I only had one address so tell me what that means and let me know if you got your box or not. Alright everyone thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. I'll probably be back with other stuff. Um, yeah, once I finish this. All right, bye-bye.